the history of odissi dance over the last 60 years is the story of the life and work of guru mayadhar raut In 1940s and 50s when Odissi was limited to the Maharis and Gotipuras Guruji founded the first Odissi school Kala Vikas Kendra in Katak in 1952 For the first time in India Odissi was taught on the basis of a syllabus giving equal emphasis on the theoretical and practical aspects of Odissi dance In 1955 Guruji was awarded a scholarship to study classical dance and theory at the Kalakshetra Adyar His training at Kalakshetra enabled him to remodel and restructure Odissi with an emphasis on abhinay Kalakshetra equipped him with shastra based knowledge with which he could codify the classical idiom of Odissi This particular slide shows Guruji as Krishna and late Sanjukta Panigrahi as Radha in Geet Govind dance drama. In 1959 a group of gurus and scholars formed Jayantika Association to redefine Odissi dance. Guruji, founder member of Jayantika, played a vital role in getting the classical status for Odissi. and putting it on the national and international map in 1970 guruji started the odissi department at shriram bharatiya kala kendra in new delhi and established odissi in the capital in 1972 the kamani auditorium was inaugurated with geet govind choreographed by guruji Guruji is the source of a distinct style of Odissi dance which is bhava pradhan There is an extensive use of mudras and intense facial expression mukha abhinaya in his style Guruji's compositions are strictly based on the rasa theory as prescribed in the Natya Shastra In 1930s and 40s Geet Govind Ashtapadis were not a part of the Odissi repertoire they were confined to the maharis who were mainly singing the ashtapadis most of the mudras were lost and the gotipuras were dancing on odia songs the odissi repertoire as it stands today is deeply indebted to guruji for introducing the geet govind ashtapadis to its repertoire he was the first odissi guru to present shringara rasa ashtapadis like pashyati dishi dishi yahi madhava and many others which have now become synonymous with odissi dance he also introduced the concept of sanchari bhava in odissi jaisa samundra hota hai स्थायी भाव है उसमें जो लहर से आते हैं वेव्स बोलते हैं या ढू बोलते हैं तरंग बोलते हैं वो सब संचारी के रूप से आता है और फिर वो पानी के अंदर लीन हो जाता है पश्यती दिशी 
Guruji has introduced the study and use of Abhinadarpana mudras and reintroduced the Abhinachandrika vocabulary to Odissi. Guruji has expanded the mudra vocabulary by adding new mudras like Gavakya and Shankasura. Training under Guru Mayadhar Raut involves a detailed study of Mudra Vinyog. He is often referred to as the master of the science of Mudras. Guruji's compositions are known for the intricacies of dance, subtlety of thought and extensive research. A great thinker and a profound scholar, Guruji's dance compositions are multi-layered and have a number of discrete nuances. One unique quality of Guru Mayadhar Raut is his strong belief in unconditional Vidyadan. A staunch believer in the Guru Shishya Parampara, he accepts his students as his family. An epitome of love and humility, Guruji not only teaches the technical intricacies of his art form, but also passes on to his students, his qualities of humility, trust, surrender, and patience. Apart from many national and international awards, Guru Mayadhar Raut has been honored with Padma Shri by the President of India in recognition of his lifetime service to the cause of Odissi. True to the spirit of the ancient Indian tradition, Guruji has never sought out the limelight. Having trained a galaxy of prominent gurus and dancers, Guruji leads a quiet and meditative life. A multifaceted philosopher, personification of simplicity, an exacting teacher, he is forever in the pursuit of perfection. Teaching and sustaining the Guru Shishya Parampara, Guru Mayadhar Raut, continues to be the high priest of Indian classical dance. Oh, uh -huh.